got a lot of things to talk about. First thing I want to talk about, we was talking about at camp. Yeah. A sketch, bro. You want to know? Yo. I ain't going to lie, bro. I don't care, bro. I'm going to watch sketch regardless, bro. So what? Hey, so what? He did a little bit of mook. I'm not jacking it. All right. Wait, no, so, no. I didn't finish it. I didn't finish it. <laughs> All right. You know what? Maybe he, he took a couple freaky pictures. He might have did some things with his mouth paws. He was in a dark time. Some people make mistakes. You know what I'm saying? It don't mean that. Like, he changed. He's not doing it now, I hope. Maybe. if he, Even if he is, I don't care. But you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I just don't understand what's the point of exposing it. Like, like what's, like they really did it for the clout. You know that, right? Exposing it? Yeah. I mean, I would expose it too if I saw it. You like, would Yo, too? peep, look at this sketch. It's free clout. It's free clout. Free clout. <laughs> yo, free he's clout? crazy. Free clout. Come on. Bro, if we was on the podcast. <laughs> hey, yo, I got some shit for y'all, bro. Hey, look what we found. Sponsored by No Regulars. Bow. And I'm sure. <laughs> like, that's sketch. <laughs> but look, my thing is, it's not a problem with him being mook. Yeah. It's a problem that, or it's not even a problem. Yeah. Nigga, that's just still crazy. <laughs> that is crazy, though. The nigga, it was like a year ago. <laughs> no, 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 no. It was two years ago. Oh, big whoop. It was two years <laughs> big ago. Big whoop, did not leave. Hey, two years. Like, was... A lot can happen in two years, bro. Regardless, it's not a problem. If you mook, you mook. Yeah, it's cool. But it was max. You was yeah. doing all that, and then now you're at the status you're at. I'm going to cook you, bro. Hey, but look. This you, was... you, you're cookable. You're liable to be cooked. Okay, this is what you happened. What I'm uh, see, this was, this was going through my mind, bro. I thought what was going on was I thought there was another person that looked like Sketch. No, nah, it's actually him. But because I seen a tweet, there was like, yeah, that's not, I'm not Sketch, this, that, there. But some, <laughs> you know, the internet, you know, this yeah, AI. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm like, okay. And I was like, wait, okay. He just takes pictures. Maybe he's just doing nah. it for the bread. But my problem is that everybody's like, he's a hero. He's so strong. Oh, he's so. Yeah, no, I don't, I don't like. Bro, I just feel bad about it, bro. It's good. I like, mean, yeah, you know I mean, what I'm saying? Like, you can feel bad about it. Like, I wouldn't not, say hero, but I mean, like. That's what I'm saying. They're like, he's so strong for doing this and gonna. Bro, own your. It, I don't think it was a mistake, but own your shit, bro. Yeah, no, like, I mean. I if was, it's an L, it's an L, bro. It's like, it's like, damn, bro. You shouldn't have. Should have locked in. Like. <laughs> You feel me? I, I like, just thought he was taking flicks. I didn't there's think consequences was, for your actions. So, yeah, I know. I didn't so think you're he, liable to get cooked. I didn't think he was going full force. I thought he was just taking flicks. Because, like, think about it. Yo, if he just taking... Like, what if he just posted it on OnlyFans just for the bread and, like, he's just taking flicks? No, that, then get your bread, but you know what you're doing now. Is he mook for that? Yeah, bro. Like, yeah. Like, he OD Even mook? if you're taking some mook, it's cool. I respect you getting bread. <laughs> but just know you're liable to cook. Like if I like, Oh, you get to get flight. Like, bro, if I if I'm like, yeah, bro, I got a million dollars. How you get that, Ty? Bro, I was with Diddy and shit. <laughs> okay. Niggas gonna be like, oh, you got mad bread tough, but you're gay. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, like I'm liable to get cooked. It's just I'm gonna have to live with it. Yeah. Now he could have not and take the pictures and not got the bread. And he'd be cool. Every action has a consequence. Bro. What I'm, what I'm, what I'm really curious about is like, was that still up on OnlyFans or did like, how did this get there? It probably was still up. So he just didn't delete it, or probably you could probably you forgot. What's on the internet? It's on the internet. Bro. I know, but like, how would they? Like, who was gonna find that? Like, who was actually digging that deep to find that A homosexual man? Like, you go on first. First, you got to go on OnlyFans. Then you got to go to the the Mookie side of OnlyFans. Then you got to pay the subscription to look at the Mookie side. And then you got to find this this alter ego of sketch in a in a Superman costume, cheeked up. Balls. I didn't see that. You saw that? Yes. <laughs> there Darius a, has problems. No, there was a lot of crazy stuff. I, I did not. No, I didn't want to see it. I just believe him. <laughs> you just believe. You didn't it even could have been at, lying to me. I believe him. <laughs> it was a lot of crazy stuff, but I ain't gonna lie. But it's like you know, I just felt bad because he said he was gonna off himself. He didn't say that. Yeah, he did say that. He was like, he, bro. He was like, he was at you know the little face crib. So when the yeah. when the whole thing got leaked out, he was at with like face banks or whatever, yeah. and he just dipped. No shoes, no glasses. Left the crib. Didn't talk to nobody. He's like, bro. And then FaZe Banks actually like talked to him to like come back home, like, yo, chill out, bro. Like, you alright. And then he and then he came on stream. He was like, Yeah, this uh uh he he knew he said when the cat was bro, like, I do not feel bad, bro. Why are niggas scared to be gay? <laughs> like I'm saying, like just own that you're gay, bro. Like it's it's cool. Like, so is he gay or is he is he No, gay? he's he's gay, bro. Oh, like he can't go back for that? <laughs> yeah, there's no once you're gay, you're gay. Like, that you is can, true. You, you that like sucks, once you're like bro. once you're gay, you're gay. There's no like Oh, well, I was. 
Well, I used to suck. Nah, you're cooked. Oh, man. Like, once you just... But it's okay, though. That's the problem. Yeah, it is. That's what I'm saying. It is why okay. Why are you ready to... <laughs> uh, like, I know. That's what I'm saying. Like, why do you just feel like... I don't think he deserves, like, non-support or support. It's just like... Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You have so much bread. I'm not saying money, you know, cures that, but like... Yeah. I mean, at the same time, it's just like, you can be like, you know... You can treat like this. Like, oh, you found out about this? Okay. Well, I mean, yeah, I did it. Do what... Uh, what's uh, that, uh, that right, rapper dude? Bro, just be like, I'll do it again. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He could have done that. He gelled. Double you know, down. Like, like uh, double down. Like, uh, what's that that rapper dude? He's like, I'm JP. JP, yeah. He was talking about he, he was having sex with a gay dude. Yeah. He was like, yeah, he up. He's like, yeah, I did it. I yeah, what's up? I'll do, I'll do it again. Like, uh, that's up? what I'm saying. I'm like, hey, like, bro. Double down, bro. Double down. Like Nobody felt bad from there. He was just like, oh, you he did didn't it. bet on himself. You double down and you bet on yourself, bro. <laughs> he, didn't do it. he didn't do it, bro. Hey, man. I don't know, bro. I just think it's like, it's, it, okay, what if this came out? What if this was like, like he was famous like ten years ago or like eight years ago, you think it would be crazy if it came out like he was like moving? Nah, like it, it would still be crazy, but like the fact that it was so recent, I'm like, yeah, bro, you're still fully into this shit. Yeah, like this. Oh, is oh, like this. Yeah, is, you're still fully. Like you, like you think about it. Like, yeah, yeah, you still knew this mind. was that. Like he just blew up last year. Like yeah, you was thinking like, damn, I was just sucking. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, bro! You think he was making bread? No. That's what I'm saying, bro. There's some people on started only... streaming. No, nah, he wasn't. Making There's that. some people. On... Oh my god! Imagine he blew up off of that. He would have still been doing this. Oh man, see, hey, hey, bro. I- I'm just saying, bro. There's people on OnlyFans that are making thirty dollars a month. Are you gonna keep doing OnlyFans, or are you gonna wait till you blow up? That's that's what I'm thinking. Thirty a month is crazy. Thirty a month is wild. <laughs> OnlyFans. Is <laughs> that is so OD. Weird. Like, there's people that's making like you know like six figures, or whatever. That's cool. But where about the people that's making thirty, forty dollars, fifty, a hundred dollars a month? Where are them people at? Are they still doing it? Or are they just like, they tried it out and they realized it didn't work? I remember when OnlyFans first came out, DDG made an OnlyFans and he was just teaching people how to blow up on YouTube. On OnlyFans? Yeah. <laughs> he was just like, he wasn't post, he was just post like, yeah, videos like, oh, this is how you blow up. Like, that's just that, like, it, it's not like a. It didn't help, did it? I mean, people were subs- uh, subscribing still, but it's like, it's not like, he was trying to say like, this app, like, this app is not just for like, like porn or corn or whatever. It's just like, I can. It's just a free subscription. Like you can just subscribe to me. I'll teach you how to how I how I got famous, which is smart. But like that's what Patreon is for. Mm. Technically, that's the thing. Follow our Patreon. I, I'm saying, hey, it, come on, bro. We already type in, bro. Type shit. But we put the same thing up there, bro. Literally, blow up, bro. Like, <laughs> yo, what? <laughs> nah. But yeah. I don't know. I hope Sketch, because I remember he said something about like he, he talked to God and was like, "Get me out of this situation and help me find a new way." And then that's how he how he became famous. But I think that's how he became famous, bro. I think it's a freaking, uh, like, you know, you sell your soul. You think so? Yeah, 100%, bro. You got to do some mook shit to, you know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, or some some against your morals. Yeah, that's what he did. Not everybody, but. So you think, like, that was, like, his first step of, like, becoming famous? I mean, that. Yeah, yeah. You think people really do sell their souls, though? Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. These like, niggas, yeah. Like, Maybe a good well. amount of people. Like, I'm talking, like, like. Most I did. Is, I feel like majority. I say like eight out of ten. Eight out of ten of yeah. like the famous people. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah, like the ones that blow up. Yeah. That's even cool. rappers and shit too. Yeah. No. No. no I, Some I, of them like instead it might be like kill somebody or something. Oh. Yeah. Or like that's, sacrifice somebody. That's instead of like OD, being mook. Bro. Diddy was just doing that shit for fun though. Oh, he was just he had he did it one time. He's like, I like this. Nah, he was like, I already like this, and then got you know. Oh, he's like, like, oh, I can be famous and do yeah. This he was like, yo, time. we can use this nigga as a recruiter, so he was a recruiter. Oh, that's od. I mean, I do think I remember. I don't know if you remember that one Asian dude that uh, he's like a comedian. He's like a little I forgot something Lee Bobby Bobby Lee. You know, oh Bobby? yes, my guy. Yeah, he was talking about how he was um he was at a freaking event or whatever, and he went to the bathroom or something upstairs, and he's seeing a bunch of people in cloaks and like candles everywhere, and he was like. Yeah, let me back. Let me walk out of there real quick. And he was just like, "Yeah, nah, I'm out of there." Wait, he was where you said? He was at an event, like a like. And you know, he just walked in and it's just yeah, like he okay. went upstairs, like you know, I guess you're not supposed to go upstairs. You went upstairs, like of the building, or whatever. And he seen there's like a like a ritual or some shit. I'm like, and he was just like, "Oh, that's kind of weird." Yeah. And he just like backed out, you know, made a couple jokes. He was yeah. like, "Yeah, there's people upstairs like in cloaks stuff. Like you guys know about this." And then everybody just looked at him like, "Why are you?" Why are Same. you talking about that? And he's like, yeah. oh, this is what we're talking about. This is what type of party is. Let me get out of here. I don't, yo, you know, stuff like that creeps me out. I ain't going to lie. Because at the end of the day, right, it's like a lot of people, I feel like, 
and there's a there's a small percentage of me that thinks that people are just saying that just to like create like a false like narrative of people selling it. So they're just saying that just to say it, just so it's like people could believe it mm-hmm. and it might not be true. But at the end of the day, there is some weird people in the freaking world. Like there's like if you look at a lot of I don't know if you've seen in the BT Awards the freaking uh Will Smith's uh he did like a performance that looked like a little ritual or something like that. Nah, I didn't see it no. It looked kinda creepy. It was like um it was crazy. It was with like a lot of the um the uh the Christian music people too. It was one of the two dudes. I don't know if you know Maverick City. There was a dude that he sings in Maverick yeah. City and he was with Will Smith and it was like uh I guess Will Smith was singing one of like the the uh, Christian songs but like he walked out it was like he was I think he was wearing red or it was red it was a lot of red mm-hmm. and there was a circle with candles and it was really dark and it looked kind of weird and a lot of like the Maverick City fans and stuff they were like looking at him like like oh this is like weird like we're not listening to him no more cuz like now he look like he's like a devil worshiper or something mm-hmm. because one of their the people in the group was with Will Smith during that whole thing i forgot what his name was jay you know what his name was it wasn't marvin sap was it Chandler Mora. That's what his mm. name is, Chandler Mora. He was one of the, he's one of the main singers of like Maverick City, like the little Christian worship groups. And he was there with Will Smith and they was looking they seen him. They was like, Oh nah, like I'm not That looks that looks crazy. sus. Like that looks crazy. So I'm like, Hey, you never know. Like you see people like Rihanna wearing all red during her freaking halftime performance, Beyonce right. looking kinda of crazy. And uh, Chris Brown be doing some wild stuff. I don't know, maybe there's something behind all this. Mm-hmm. Okay. Now I got a question. Do you think LeBron sold his soul? No. Nah. You don't think so? He's the one. Hey, think about it, bro. He's the chosen one. Look, I look. He's the king. Look, if anybody sold their soul in that, that is in sports, it would be Le- I feel like it'll be Le- it'll be LeBron more than Michael Jordan. Because think about it. <clears throat> okay, go ahead. Think about it. Think I, about it. Because, right? My Bible would be cooked here, but go ahead. Michael Jordan. <laughs> he's like, yeah, he yeah, just yeah. Sat, yo, people, he just sat up and he just turned his whole body yeah, to yeah, yeah, you. I bet. Cool.